What's up guys, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and in today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to build a basic membership website. Now, I know I've made tons of videos about a paid membership website, um, but in this video, I'm going to show you upon video request from uh, just a comment that I received on one of my videos, how to make a basic uh, regular membership website here in Wix. He specifically asked using Wix code, um, so what I'm gonna say is that it's really no different right now creating a membership website in Wix using Wix code versus uh, just regular Wix editor. However, at the same time, I, that statement's a little bit contradic contradicting because um, it is different at the same time because in Wix code, you can now create member profiles and stuff like that. However, that is going to be shown to you in our next video. And then as soon as I get confirmed the paid membership website uh, feature in Wix code, I will release a tutorial. So that way when Wix code is released to you guys, whether you get it via applying the beta for the beta or when it just is released to all Wix users, you can come back to my video and reference it. But for right now, I'll show you how to turn the Wix code developer tools on once again. And then I'll show you how to build just a basic membership website here in Wix. Before we get into it, guys, don't forget to go to wixmywebsite.com. Sign up for these weekly Wix tips. You don't want to miss them. Uh, read about me. Uh, this web design page is coming very soon. Guys, I've had a ton of requests for my personal web design services. I love it. I encourage you guys, if you have uh, any uh, redesign work you're looking for on your website or you're looking to build your first Wix website but you don't have the time or you're struggling with it this web design page is going to be live within the next day or two and it has a complete form that you fill out so I can gather the information and then I will contact you guys as soon as I get that information uh, to schedule our first call also guys don't forget to check out the workshops uh, we'll have some upcoming ones. Thank you to everyone yesterday who was on our workshop. And don't forget to get connected in the community and read some blog posts that are very helpful. Now, to create a membership website here in Wix, um, well, let me show you how to turn on the developer tools. You go up to tools, developer tools, and then bam, your developer tools are on. Truthfully, you're not really going to need them in this video, but I did want to show you how to turn them on as I kind of made this twist on a little bit more of a Wix code tutorial. Um, so you're simply gonna come in here to add. You're going to go down and you'll click member login. Then you have a member login button. You put this button wherever you want. However, I would recommend uh, you put it up in your header somewhere so that way it's on all of your pages so that they can see that notification, um, you know, login. Uh, and they could sign up and log in easily up there. The uh, other thing is you now need to restrict pages. So now that you have your member login button, if you click here, login, sign up, it uh, prompts somebody to log in or sign up. Uh, in the member login button, if we go back to the editor, you can choose, we'll double click it here, click the settings, you can choose what language the button is in and then the member sign up settings here. Sorry guys. So for this, you can choose whether you approve each person that signs up or everyone can be a member. Um, if you click everyone, that means whoever signs up is automatically approved right then and can get into all of your member only pages. If you choose people I approve, that means that you have to approve them before they can actually access any of the pages. And then what option shows first, so you can choose whether it's it prompts people to sign up first or log in first, that's completely up to you. And you could even allow social login too, so people can sign in via Google or Facebook. Um, so once you choose those settings, you click done. And then it's this simple guys, so what you need to create member pages. So if you want only members to see your workshop page in this case, you would come in here to home, go down to workshops, click that, and then you would click permissions. In permissions, you would simply click members only. Now, I'm not gonna do it because I'm not making this a members only page, but that's as simple as it is, and you press done, and all people have to do is log in, and then they could access that page, and if they try to click that page, it will prompt them to either sign up or log in, and it's that simple. That's how you create a membership website here in Wix and in Wix code. 
Same method for both, and it's that easy. I hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, drop me a like down below. I know this was kind of a passing in between type of video. I uh, wasn't quite Wix code, but at the same time, um, it probably does help some of you out. Um, like I mentioned to you, in my upcoming videos, you can expect to see how to create member profiles in Wix code, how to create a paid membership website, like the official way, no more flaws in Wix code, um, and then I'll have a couple more rolling out after that. Guys, I head to college. Uh, I leave for college in about uh, a week. Tomorrow marks a week. A week from tomorrow, I head out. So that whole week that I'm moving in and driving out there, uh, there will be no videos uh, as I'm you know, going to get adjusted to everything um, and move into my dorm and everything like that. So next week, there won't be any videos. But this whole week coming up, uh, you'll see a lot of videos. You'll see a lot of emails, blog posts, as I'm going to try to spread as much information to you guys as possible, being that I'm going to be out for a week. Um, guys, don't forget to come check out these weekly Wix tips. Uh, check out the blog, the community, uh, read about me. And then, this, like I said, this web design page will be done soon. Comment if you have any questions at all. If there's any in particular tutorials you would like to see, uh, whether that's in the Wix editor or starting out with Wix code. I know you guys really don't know Wix code yet, so I'll probably be showing and coming up with all those tutorials. But any questions you have in Wix, drop them down in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD at Gilbert for some more awesome tech content. Other than that, guys, I will catch you on the next one. Thank you very much.